Hello everyone, I'm your host Rocky Bomb, and we will be looking into Shiv 2's Secret Cows. So, it is no secret that Shiv 2 has a bunch of different little easter eggs along the way, and the ones I'm focusing on is the cows, because I saw them in game and I went on a journey and a half to find them all, and I'm going to show you guys where they all are. So we're starting at the tournament grounds. This cow is very hard to see at first, but I managed to find it with the help of my friend. And it's simply, if you look through here, you can actually see it in that tent over there. Or you can see it over here a little bit better, if you're a spectator that is, it's over there. But I'll get you a better view. And to get a better view, we can get out of map at this section. We just fly upward and we fly around. This lets you get out of the map, you can, you know, view the whole map. It's not that impressive out here, honestly. Um, but what's most impressive is this lovely cow being in this shelter. Slaughter of Coxwell. This is where you start in killing the peasants, of course, and they'll always lose. Agatha always has, you know, the worst luck of maps in this game, honestly. It's very bad. But... We go through to the end, like so, and we make it to the end point of Coxwell, and the cow is actually in here, made of gold instead of brown like the others, because Coxwell is just full of gold and the masons want this cow, this is the main point of this map, I promise. It's pretty hard to see, but if you stand on this platform you can see it pretty well, if you're in game. And here we are at the Battle of Wardenglade. This is the easiest cow to find, and this is the one which gets posted online the most. And it's just over here on the Agathon side to the left. We follow it out here, and it's just behind this tree here. This beautiful cow. And this is the only cow I believe you can actually reach in game. And interact with him to make him into a unicorn, like so. And here we are on Lion Spire. This is where you start on the beach and you have to get the battling rams all the way up. This uh, cow is actually pretty close. It is just up this wall and you can see it right there. This was, a, this was actually one of the harder ones I found to find. And yeah, there he is. I can't actually get to him for you guys, but yeah, he's there. Here we are at the Battle of Dark Forest where you start right around here. And the cow is actually further up the road. It is at this section, which is the uh, the small bridge, which is pretty hard to push through. All you have to do is follow this path all the way up. You can actually reach this cow before hitting an invisible wall here. But here he is. This cow is located in Rudhelm. This was actually the hardest cow for me to find. First, we... Uh, head on over here and it's just on this wall you can actually see the silhouette so he's actually in here it's a bit hard to see hang on I'll get my camera up and here's the cow he's just hiding in his little home here it's actually like almost impossible to see without gamma in there but the real way you're supposed to see it is just from this window you're supposed to see his little head silhouette there this map is the Escape from Falmir, where you start by releasing your peasantries. And the cow is actually at the end, where you have to release your champion in this window here. There he is, he's just little hitting there. It's actually Im almost impossible to see him. You can only see him slightly there, and a little better from over here. This is probably where you're supposed to see him best. But, once again, you need Gamma up to properly see this guy. So he's a little hidden guy. Now we'll go to the fighting pit, and this one was the hardest one for me to find. Maybe. Except for Rodhelm. For you see, I could not actually see it properly until I looked up here in this picture. And he's right standing there. And you can and you can see him right here in this little intro bit. Up in the left corner. Now, it took me a while to find this one because, as you can see, it's not up there for me. But
but I found out if you change your render distance in video view distance to epic then you can see the cow up there as you can see but it still disappears at this point but that's a little sneaky cow up there and that is all the cows thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed i had so much fun finding these cows because honestly i found the one in dark forest and then i found the one in warden glade and i just got stuck on these guys like i was obsessed with finding them because I, I couldn't find any video online to find them so i did it myself well i hope this helps you guys and if you want to view them go and see it yourself and i hope you enjoy see you next time